Hi Aries, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for April 7th until 13th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. I have a very bad cold again, so... Um... Yeah. I hope that you can understand my, uh, my words. I always have colds. I don't know why it doesn't really go away. Oh. <clears throat> okay. Looks like this week, Aries, you are going to be, you know, doing good. Well, you miss your friends. You miss going out. You also miss hanging around with a few people that you, you know, that you know, that you're also close to. And I feel like at this point, you need to be a little bit more, you know, relaxed. If for the past few weeks, you've been like under a lot of stress and you've been like working so hard, you've been worried about a lot of things that's going to happen and unfold. And you're also worried about your safety. But then this week, you can finally breathe and relax and, you know, like, um, you don't really have to worry too much about your safety as well. Um... I feel like you will also start making some plans for your friends because you've been feeling a little bit lonely and even if you will try to let's say for example from um, for, for the first three days of the week you will start thinking about you know making plans with your friends going out with your friends or hanging out with them and then right in the fourth week you know sorry in the fourth day you will still start feeling a little bit more withdrawn, you know, feeling a little bit more depressed and not really in the mood. And <clears throat> it's like you will try and look for somebody to talk to, like how you really feel about life, you know, the, your fears that you've been feeling lately. And also some of the things that you're kind of a little bit unsure, like where is your life going? Now, money is coming in this week. And I feel like there is also very good news that you'll be receiving. If you're also waiting for some um, news from the government or news from banks, insurance, or something like that, like you're trying to apply, getting a loan, you'll definitely be getting a very positive news this week and you will be getting it. Now, <clears throat> you will also be walking away from another fire sign that is older than you. And despite of you trying to communicate and trying to bridge their communications, this person remains stubborn and very walled up. So you feel like there's nothing that I can do. You know, there's nothing that I can really extend myself to because I have done everything I could to fix this up. But, you know, the person is the one who already shut me down. So there's nothing left for me to do but to walk away. Now... There is a choice that you have to make that even though you're struggling to make it, you're struggling to do it because a part of you feels like, you know, like half of you is left with that person and you just can't seem to give up because you know that there's still something, you know, that's left and that there's still something that you can still look forward to. But then you feel like, no, you know, I have to do this to myself. I have to do myself a favor and I need to turn my back into this situation. But right before that happens... Okay, there is somebody that you both know or a person that this person is also close to and you're also close to and then there will be a news that you will also be receiving with regards to the situation of this person and that is how you will be changing your your mind. Okay, like all of your inhibitions, your you know, the things that you were thinking about this person, it will just suddenly wipe out that you will be it will be changed with much more compassion and you will also feel so guilty for judging the situation or this person easily knowing that what they are going through right now is even more it's you know it's even more much more difficult than what you're going through as well now so a part of you will somehow feel like why is it that he can't just ask for help from me you know that i'm here so why does he need to be stubborn about asking for help 
Um, I feel like in the end you will be staying. And uh, even though you've already made some plans <clears throat> about traveling within the second day or within the next two days or two weeks, you will start, you know, giving this person's situation more consideration. Like, should you, should you not, you know? And you'll be making a decision of not going. Now, there will be a trick that somebody will be playing upon you, and this is from a water sign person, that you've been, like, trying to build up your walls, or that you've been trying to protect yourself from. And unfortunately, that this person, you know, when they try to woo you, or when they try to get close to you, even if you'll try to forgive them, and even if you'll give them another chance, I feel like what they're going to do is just to get back at you and then run away from you. And then you will also be telling yourself that you shouldn't have let this person into your life again. I feel like this is more of a family member or somebody the, that you used to live with. Because um, I feel like this person have a lot of, uh, not really feelings, but... I feel like they just wanted to get back at you, you know, for whatever happened in the past. And now they're also trying to, you know, they're also trying to regain back their, um, their integrity because of what happened in the past. That you have tried to keep yourself away from this person for a long period of time and now you thought that since it's been like years or months since the last time you have interacted with each other, you thought that this person is already over that situation. But unfortunately, they only waited for the right time to get back at you. Okay, so be very careful. Now, work-wise, I feel like you are also planning to take some time off or to take a quick break because you're feeling a little bit burned out. You feel like you're overburdened, overwhelmed with a lot of things that's been going on in your life lately. And yes, there is a uh, very promising position that already awaits you, but you feel like you just need some time off just to find yourself again. Regain back your energy and yourself and your confidence as well. And good thing here is you will be getting the deal you'll be getting the contract a person who's an air sign will finally be signing in with you or will be giving you the deal that you've been waiting for or if there are something that you're trying to fight for okay there will be a victory but at the same time this is going to be a very depressive and emotional week for you aries all right so anyway just hold on tight there everything will be okay and this will all surpass this is only like what it's only a weekly thing okay who knows that next week you'll be much more happier and livelier all right so that's it for you for this week aries and if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net blessings to you